In the next couple of minutes, you will learn how to respond to cardiac arrest. Imagine that you come across someone laying on the ground unmoving. The first thing to do is check if he is conscious. Hold his hand and speak loudly. Open your eyes. Squeeze my hand if you can hear me. If he doesn't react, check his breathing. Gently tilt his head back, lower your head, and watch for a rise in his stomach or chest for 10 seconds maximum. Here, the man is unconscious and his chest isn't rising. He's in cardiac arrest. Stay calm. You only have three things to do. First, call emergency services. On your phone, dial 112. At the same time, retrieve your defibrillator Clark if it's within immediate proximity. Place your phone on speaker next to you so emergency services can guide you until they arrive. Stay calm. Remove all clothes from victim's chest. Peel pad number one from its plastic liner and stick the pad to the bare skin of the victim, exactly as shown in the picture. Peel pad number two from its plastic liner and stick the pad to the bare skin of the victim, exactly as shown in the picture. Once the electrodes are attached, do not touch the victim. The defibrillator alone decides what therapy to deliver. Stand clear. Device charging. Delivering shock in three, two, one, shock delivered. Start CPR immediately once the shock is delivered. To perform CPR, place the heel of your hand in the middle of the chest on the bottom half of the sternum. Interlace your hands and perform chest compressions at a rhythm of 100 compressions per minute, five centimeters deep. All you need to do is follow Clark's rhythmic beat. For effective CPR, keep your arms perpendicular to the victim and lock your elbows in order to keep your arms straight. Do not stop CPR until emergency services arrive or until the defibrillator announces a new analysis. Your Clark defibrillator stops every two minutes to analyze the victim's cardiac rhythm and decides if another shock is necessary or not. All you have to do is follow Clark's instructions. Now you have all the information you need and you're ready to go. See, you don't need to save a life.